Right guys, this is the uh, second tool haul I got off my mate's junk. So when I got there, he got the other two items off the van and negotiated a price for those five, four items. And then I went through his van and this is what I found inside his van. Um, now this is a very expensive um, sharpening stone made in the USA. Um, ultra fine grit. So super happy to find these, that. And um, that's a very nice find. So I found that and um, those run about $60. I'll insert a picture. So the one I found was about £60, I think, uh, plus £5 shipping for a used one. So I don't know how much they would be new. Um, I got this one, which is kind of unusual, the way it's sort of... Um, it's hard to get in this box. It's a bit of a funny... Bit of a funny box to be honest bit of a weird one i'm not sure anyway you can see it's kind of concaved um, but i imagine that looks to be quite an expensive one as well um, i got these three japanese tools with the other japanese plane this is a japanese chisel 18 millimeter now they sell these in axminster they're about 50 pounds each and i think these smaller ones are about 20 or 30 pounds so they're quite good all around Japanese chisels. Um, and then this must be the hammer which he was using to adjust that plane, I would have thought, unless he had another one, which I didn't see, which is quite possible. So, yeah, so this is a, uh, um, a nice little uh, 225 gram hammer, which is very cool. Um, so I was very happy with the chisels and this uh, sharpening stones. Um, and I'll show you what else I got. Right guys, so this is what else I got. Um, I got two tap and die sets, and these are Roebuck, uh, Roebuck brand or something, Roebuck. Um, and these go, this set goes from, um, I think it's half inch, yeah, half inch to quarter inch, uh, half inch to quarter inch. And it's got the Roebuck handles. They do need a wire wheel because everything's showing a bit of rust. So it's got the tap handles, the die handles, two different sizes of the die, two different sizes of the tap. So that's kind of cool. I got this box of um, router bits. There's a couple of Trend router bits, which is a really good router, and then a couple of cheapies. Um, and then there's a few router bits here. So yeah, there's a few router bits and little bushings and stuff. So I grabbed that because I've got um, a quarter inch router. Um, and then this is the metric side. So I think they go from, is it M14? Let's have a look. M12 down to smaller sizes. It's not missing any. What does that say there? M4. So it's got all the sizes, all the sizes. And then here it's got the dies as well. Then the same again, it's got the die handles. Obviously filthy dirty, so it needs a good clean. But I don't have many good taps. So to have a wood tray like this, um, even though that looks like to be beach. So this is a Roebuck brand and Roebuck make high speed tap set and they make high quality. Now I did Google these, they run about £120 each um, because they're a good quality set. So I was quite happy to pick those up. So yeah, so basically I got two tap sets and those. And then on this side, I got um, a Trend router. Um, which is also very filthy, but Trend are a good brand in the UK. I got eight shatterproof Marples chisels, all heavily rusty. They need to go on the wire wheel. Um, and then I got, which is quite funny really, I bought these um, Tormac guide sets for a Tormac sharpener. And it's funny because today I bought a Tormac sharpener for my mate Anthony. So I've just been round to his because he, he said he had some smalls in I could have a look at. So it's got four guides for a Tormac sharpener here. Um, and I just bought one, so that's kind of cool. So I might keep those and use those with the Tormac uh, sharpening system. So yeah, so basically I got set chisels, um, a trend router. We've got all these Tormac guides, they run about 50 pounds each. Um, and then I got the two tap sets um, and the, and the um, extra router bits in quite a nice leatherman tin actually and then i got these japanese chisels so yeah quite a good set of um tool haul this time so uh thanks for watching if you got this far don't forget to put your guesses in the description to enter the competition all right thanks for watching bye